Hey guys, it's Shelly Crane. I know, you're shocked. I said I was going to make a video at the end of the week. Well, I know it's Monday or Tuesday or something. but And I'm actually making the video. So, here we go. This is Q&A video number two. Um, I got some pretty cool questions. And it's Tuesday, so we have a teaser. I'm so excited to give it to you. It's awesome and juicy. Um, so um, I'm going to be talking about the new book. Um, kind of a release update, maybe, sort of. Not really, but kind of. Um, and a teeny bit of a TV update. And then we'll answer some questions. And then the teaser. All right, so let's dive in. First question. A character Bible. Want one, not want one. Hmm. I'm going to leave that up to you. Um, I know for Collide, I probably should have done one. Because there was about a bajillion characters. That was a fail on my part. But for this series, I don't know. Do you need one? Should I have done one? Do you want one? If you want one, let's just comment below in the video. If you do, I will make it so. It will happen. All right. Number two. Yeah, will I ever do another book for Kate and Maggie? Oh boy. Well, whoever you are, question asker. You know, I'm sorry. And the reason being, it's because we have explored them I think all we can we have jumped the shark for Caleb and Maggie um you know their last book was the the Valentine's uh, novella consequence I think that was my last hurrah for them um for the books that are coming you know, we'll do, we'll do some other characters. I told you guys each book is going to be a different set of characters. But they, I don't know. Yeah, they will be present though. I'm telling you, I am really loving writing those two. They're kind of the new Rachel and Peter of the group. And they're so fun. You'll see that in the teaser when I, when at the end, kind of that dynamic. And I really love them that way. Um, it's really fun writing them that way. So um, don't be distressed because you're not getting, you feel like you're not getting Caleb and Maggie because they are all in this thing. So don't, don't be sad. It'll be okay. And I hope you like the teasers of Ava and Seth so far. And you move along with, you know, the series. And, yeah. I will say that this book is killing me. I love this book. I mean, seriously. I have not loved a book like this in so long. I mean, I, I loathe this book, and it's killing me, but I love this book. That's a good thing. I mean, it, for me to be this, just, uh, but a book has not happened in so long, so that's a good thing for you guys. So, we'll talk about that a little bit more later, so don't be distressed about Caleb and Maggie. Just don't. Everything will be fine. All right. 
moving on. More, more books to come in the series. Okay, we, we talked about that a little bit. There are more. Each book will have a different set of characters. How many? Mm. You know, I'm not gonna say. At, at least three. That's safe. Me and my my girl Lila Felix kind of hashed out the names of the the books in the series one night. She's my my idea buster. Um, at least three. I'll say that. That's safe. Okay. Um, what we got here? Um, for the TV stuff, they have, um, a few really important meetings this month. I'm trying to, like, tone down my, my excitement, because the, the stuff that they're telling me is, like, literally, I could burst out of my skin. I, I want to tell you guys so bad. It's like, the camera's right here, and I could just, like, blurt it out so easily. But I won't. I will tell you that it's insane, the stuff that is going on behind the scenes, and just, I, I, I just want to just let you know that I hope to be able to tell you more in a bit because keeping secrets from you hurts my soul. I will leave you with that. Okay. Moving on. Um the I found the theme song. If you have downloaded the Spotify playlist for Under Night Be Chosen, go and add the song. I listened to it the day before yesterday. Echo Smiths surround you. It is the theme song. Go and add it. It is ridiculous how amazing the song is for Tefaneva. Not just for them, but just for the entire like race. It's ridiculous. Go listen to it. I'm gonna add the link under there right now. Go. All right. Moving along. Okay. Here's a good question. Can't wait for Ava. Squealing for joy. Please finish the book already. Spare me because I'm dying to read it. Ha ha ha. Maybe in 2015? Beep beep beep. Alright. Yes. I'm going to finish the book in 2015. I promise you. I know that I said the book was I was shooting for the end of the year, and I was. Um, I, I I tried to zoom that in there, and like I said, me and the book are having a really love hate relationship. As the book is sitting right now, like I wrote over a thousand words this morning before this video and and as it sits right now it's sitting at 72,000 words and I am nowhere near done and and th that's good for you it's it's gonna be a big book if you remember the first significance book was like 133,000 words so, you know, I don't, I don't know how much I have left exactly because I'm a pantser and I don't have this all planned out, but in my head, you know, I can, I can, I can imagine how many thousands of words I have left and I'm just not anywhere near the end. So it's going to be a big one. So I'm, I'm hoping that you're happy about that. I mean, it sucks that I'm not near the end yet and that you can't have the book, but 
Um, and I'm sorry that you didn't have it at the end of the year. And I am working on it every morning. Me and my Felix and Jamie Maggie have our little sprinting section that we knock out a few thousand words. We are busting this thing out. They are busting my butt trying to get this thing out for you guys. Um, that's all I can tell you at this point is that I'm trying to get everything um, situated with me and then knocking out everything I can with this book for you guys. I still can't tell you exactly when. As soon as I know, I will let you know and we will get this thing done. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Who is your favorite character? Um, I know everybody expects me to say Caleb. But, you know, he's, a, he's definitely a close second. My favorite book is probably going to surprise you because it's wide open. Um, I loved that book just... That was my hardest book I, I ever wrote. Um... But my favorite character is Merrick. And the reason is because he was the first guy I ever put down on paper. You know? He was everything I was looking for when I went to the bookstore and I couldn't find in the books I was reading. You know? Um, he, he loves Sherry just all consuming he's watched everything that she's ever done good and bad and he still came to earth and just you know wanted to find her and still just adored her to pieces even knowing everything she's ever done i mean please it's ridiculous so yeah i think i don't think he will ever be taken his spot will ever be taken as my favorite guy just because he was my first. So, okay. All right. I'm going to move on to the teaser now. The teaser that I'm so excited about. Okay. Sorry. Hi. All right. I appropriately gasp and let slip the little moan that caused him to growl which set off a new round of deep kisses and we started all over again as he dove in. Before Rodney walked in, without knocking, but we didn't see him. In great. So this is what I have to look forward to, we heard to my right and gasp, scrambling up to stand beside the bed as he kept going. When I get myself bonded, huh? Late for school because I'm making out when I should be downstairs eating breakfast my mother cooked with the family that's been waiting for 15 minutes. I struggled to get my breaths under control as Seth did the same, clearing his throat. Seth was a lot taller than Rodney by a good bit, but Rodney was my brother after all. Rodney, come on, I complained. Not next time. I did, he said, and made a gross face. I rolled my eyes and pushed his arm to shoo him. We'll be down in a minute. Let me change my clothes. Whoa, he turned. Then Jolly Green Giant needs to come with me. I opened my mouth to lay into him, but Seth gripped my arm. I'm going. He's right. Get dressed. I grumbled. I would have put you out before I got dressed. He smirked. Would you now? I giggled. Rodney rolled his eyes. God, please don't ever let me imprint. Keep me celibate. He patted his big, stupid, judgy feet down the hall, and I glared at his back. Seth laughed. I swung my gaze on him. What are you laughing at? He'll get his, he promised. He just doesn't know what this feels like. He rubbed his thumb against mine. I swooned in a puddle by my bedroom door. His smile grew. I'll wait for you downstairs. You could go fast if you want to. I will. I'll have mercy. Tell them not to wait for me to eat. I took care with the fastest shower I've ever taken, and with what I put on, I didn't feel like a t-shirt and jeans day, so I put on my leggings with a crop dress and the infinity scarf Mom and I got in London last year. Threw on my boots. Left my hair in loose waves, slicked on some light makeup, and booked it downstairs. When I entered the kitchen, where breakfast nook was, everyone stopped eating and talking. 
which made me feel so uncomfortable until Steph stood up so fast that his chair must take over behind him. He let out a slow, low noise before, wow. Mom chuckled and leaned back with a smile, clapping twice. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how it's done. <laughs> okay. That's it. They, they are just so fun. It's ridiculous how fun they are. They're still just the most fun family to write. I have just missed them so much. I mean, even though Peter and Rachel and the whole family are there, like I said, it's like Caleb and Maggie are the new Peter and Rachel of the family. So it's just ridiculous. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, like I said, I am booking it to get this book done. I hope I have um, a better update for you soon. Um, once I get closer to the end of the book, at the rate I'm going, um, like I said, Lyle and Jamie are kicking my butt. So hopefully I'll have it done soon and um, I'll have some more information for you. Um, I'll have some links under there for you for the song and, and all that good stuff. If you haven't read the first book, Significance is free. If you know any of your friends who haven't read it, Significance is free. I'll put a link under there. Um, in the meantime, you know, um, today is Tuesday. And um, next Tuesday I'll have a teaser. Every, te every Tuesday I try to put out a teaser. I'm sorry if I don't. You can remind me. Um, you know I forget these things. I'm sorry. Um, my husband tells me every week, you know, something about this Tuesday. I'm like, oh my gosh, I forgot it's Tuesday, Tuesday. So, it's fine if you remind me. I'm bad about these things. I'm usually in a cave and I just don't remember. So, um, I'll try to remember. And, um, in the meantime, just thank you guys for being awesome and being patient. And, um, I will just book it to get this book done. And, um, see you soon. I have a couple signings coming up. You can see them on my site under the events tab. There's a few under there. All right.